Hi Dyson and welcome to our art lesson today. Okay, let me share my screen. Oh, no, that's the wrong button, Miss Walker. Hold on. And we can get started. Okay. Here we go. Okay. Okay, the first thing I'd like you to do is have a look at this painting. This is a very famous painting. You may have seen it, you may not have seen it, but both of those things are okay. What I'd like you to do is pause the video and have a think about what's happening in this picture. And what can you see in this picture? Can you pause me very quickly and talk to um, whoever you're with about what you can see and what you think is happening in this picture? Okay, welcome back. Hopefully you've got lots of ideas. This painting is called, my turn, Umbrellas. Umbrellas. Fantastic. And this is by an artist called, my turn, Renoir. Renoir. And today we will be asking ourselves, can I ask and answer questions about Renoir and umbrellas? OK, so that is our learning objective today. Now, this man here is Renoir. This is the artist who painted that painting. Um, and his full name is Pierre Auguste Renoir. Um, he was born in 1845, at uh, 41, sorry, <laughs> 1841, and he died in 1919. That means he was born over 170 years ago. Can you believe it? He spent four whole years working on this painting. And if you wanted to see this painting in real life now, you could go to the National Gallery in London and that is where you would find it. So. Now what I'm going to ask you to do is the first task and the first task is to have a think about these three questions. OK. What you're going to be doing is recording your answers and posting them to me on Tapestry. OK, so the first question is, what do you like about the picture? OK, that's the first question. What do you dislike about the picture? That means what don't you like? And what patterns do you see? So I'd like you to stop the video now, and record yourself answering these questions, okay? Well done. Hopefully you're back and you've answered all three of those questions. Now, this is a very long word, but we're going to do my turn, your turn. Impressionism. Impressionism. Fantastic. Now, impressionism is a style of painting. So it's how the artist paints. Impressionists, who are the people who do this style of painting, they often do their paintings outside. But the idea is that they try to capture the light and the movement that they see in their paintings. You can also often see their brush strokes if you look closely at the paintings. That's kind of part of what tells us what Impressionism is. OK, so today we will be asking questions about umbrellas. We've already answered a few questions, haven't we? We've made those videos. Now we need to ask some questions, okay? When we're asking questions, we use question words. 
And those are these words in red here. So we've got who, what, when, where, why, and how. Okay, let's do my turn, your turn. Who, what, when, where, why, and how. Fantastic. And when we're asking questions, we also put a question mark at the end of our questions, don't we? Yeah, we know that one. So we are going to be thinking of some questions um, about this painting. And I'm going to start us off by thinking of a, a few of my own, okay? So I'm going to stop sharing my screen. Hopefully you can see, can you see this? Yeah. And I'm going to ask some questions. Now, I'm looking at the painting and I, the first thing I really think is, why are they all wearing the same color? That's what, that's what I want to know. So that's going to be my first question going to stop sharing for a minute and write that question. Why are they all wearing the same colour? Okay, so here I go. <clears throat> my question was, why are they all wearing the same colour? What is my question word in that sentence? Why? Fantastic. So I'm going to write it in red. I'm going to stand on this side. Is that okay? Why? Why? Oh, can you see that very well? Why? Maybe I need a thicker pen. Oh dear, give me one second. Okay. Why are they all wearing the same colour? So I'm good. Have you noticed? I've already got my capital letter. Now, we're not in English, but it doesn't matter. Every time we write anything, we need to remember our capital letters, our finger spaces and our full stops. OK, so why are they all wearing the same colour? Why, finger space, are they Why are they all wearing the same? Colour might do it down here. Why are they all wearing the same colour? Now, what was it that we had to put at the end of our sentences? Oh, yes, thank you. A question mark because we're asking a question. OK, let's have a look at the painting again and let me think of Let's say one more question before I let you think up your own. OK, here's the painting. I do want to know why they're wearing all the same colour. I also want to know, where are they? That, that's a good question that I'd like to ask. Now, what is the question word that I just used in that sentence? Hmm, where, good. So where are they? Where are they? Oh, I nearly did my question mark in blue. Got to put my question mark on the end. 
where are they? Now, those are a couple of my questions. I've got a lot more, but I think I'm going to let you um, make up your own. So what I would like you to do, let me share my screen again, is, oops, here we go. I would like you to write your own questions, okay? So I would like you to have a look at the painting, go back, there you go, and pause the video and have a look at this painting. Write your own questions. Now make sure that you include the important question words and a question mark for each one. And you also use your capital letters, finger spaces and full stops. Now your challenge today, if you'd like to do it, is can you use all of the question starters? So that would mean using who, what, when, where, why and how in six different sentences, okay? So that is your challenge if you would like to do that. But otherwise, I would like you to write your questions about the painting umbrellas, okay? Um, I'd like you to please post the questions onto Tapestry and post your video from earlier onto Tapestry, okay? If you can, um, please try and post your video and your questions together in one post because it's all the same piece of work, okay? Good luck writing your questions. I'm looking forward to, want, um, to hearing what you want to know. And don't worry about not knowing the answers. The whole point of us asking questions is that we find out the answers because we've asked the questions, okay? So, good luck. Bye Dyson. <laughs>